Hello traders, uh, hello traders, uh, the title of the video is a stochastic uh, indicator, uh, trading tips and tricks for stochastic uh, traders. In this tutorial, I want to highlight uh, a specific uh, stochastic pattern and uh, give to traders tips and tricks that they can use when they are trading uh, this uh, specific uh, stochastic uh, pattern, all right? As I explained to stochastic uh, traders before, is that when you purchase the 24 SP trading material, you want to take a pattern, all right, and try to master it. Use a demo account, choose a pattern that you like, work on it, work on it, until you master it. Uh, this is the purpose of this tutorial. And uh, uh, one of the patterns that we were talking about is when a stochastic formed a double bottom uh, chart pattern. This is one example case here. It came down and formed a very clean uh, double bottom. I talked about it in the previous video, uh, how that pattern is formed. We don't want it to go all the way to the overboard zone. This is how we want it gently like this and come back down without this part going to the overboard zone. So this is a, a distinctive, a beautiful, okay, stochastic uh, pattern here. Now, what I want to add to this uh, trading tutorial, talking about uh, trading tips and tricks, is that this particular stochastic pattern, very often, the best one will be formed after the price is retesting, okay, a prior high. This particular stochastic pattern, when you see it, at the time when the price is retesting a prior high, very often, it happened to be a very, very rewarding a stochastic pattern. So, if you forget everything else that I said today, just remember that, that this particular double bottom stochastic pattern, at the time when the prior test the prior high, more likely to be a high probability trading setup. One will use a different time frame trading method to control the risk because this is just a trading setup. One will break it down the setup, the signal, and the low risk entry point, taking into consideration the economy news, the fundamental, or in general, the trading triangle, all right? So you see how it works here? So you see this prior high here, I'm talking about this one here, it's a prior high, prior went above, 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 prior high. Look, at the time when the prior was breaking above that prior high, that's the pink line here. So you see here, it went above the first time, came back down, went above it, came back down, here again, went above it, came back down. Now, yeah, he breaks a bow, all right? And he was retesting it. If you like, I place a vertical line there as the trader showed me last time. Right? He breaks a bow, you see this here, and retest it there, all right? With all kind of blah, blah, blah going on. That's why you want to use a top down to the middle. It was a bit messy, volatile, because of previous resistance here, you see, because of those resistance here. So, but the pattern did take place at the time when the prior was retesting a prior high. So, the, uh, if you survive the volatility here, look what's happened. Boom, up. All right. So here you can see here, we have another one here. You see here, it formed a double bottom chart pattern, but the prior was not retesting a prior high. And also, as I told you, once you locate the pattern, Put the pattern aside and concentrate on what? The market pattern. So here you can see that it was a stochastic pattern, but you put it aside, the prior was not retesting the prior high when we have this double bottom pattern. And also, if you consider, you switch your attention to the market pattern, it was a declining channel. It was a declining channel, could break a bowie, could be break a bowie, but until it breaks a bowie, yeah, here it is, now it breaks a bowie here. You see here, so the pattern was here, but the prior was still in a declining channel and couldn't break that declining channel. So if you did buy here, you should take into consideration the market pattern, knowing that there's a high channel, the bearish trader will try to sell it here. Or after you identify the pattern, like you say, all right, allow it to break above the declining channel. All right, so one more thing, talking about, uh, all right, Stochastic indicator, trading tips and tricks for stochastic traders. The double bottom stochastic pattern, the best one very often will take place when the price breaks above the prior high and retest it. It's a good example here. Another scenario is when the price okay, breaks above, all right, 
a declining channel and retest it or break a ball, all right? Uh, horizontal channel and retest it. So those are the three best uh, uh, stochastic pattern, this particular one, that you, mark, you may come across, right? So when you see like this, the price consolidation from a double bottom, or the price was, uh, because it's a bullish pattern, you see that is in a declining channel, you say, all right, let's see whether it's going to break above and retest it. So you can put this on your bullish watch list and wait until it breaks above the channel and retest it. And then from there, you start trading it. But if you start trading it here, be very, very careful. The reason why sometimes traders lose when they are using a stochastic pattern is just because they are ignoring the market pattern. And second, they are not applying a top-down trading method because it's about a trading material. It's not a trading system. It's a trading material that reveals to traders 13 specific stochastic patterns. All right, so this is the, uh, the objective of this tutorial today. It's a short tutorial just to help traders, okay, to master, okay, the stochastic uh, patterns, all right? If you have any question or suggestion, okay, feel free to put in the comment section. And in the course, I will be recording another video to answer your specific uh, question, all right? Financial instrument that we are analyzing today is uh, CA, C for Charlie, A for Alpha, C A incorporated a stock belonging to the technology sector. So this will conclude our discussion today about the stochastic indicator, uh, trading tips and tricks for stochastic uh, traders. Okay, if you have any question or suggestion, put in the comment section. All right. If you like this video, please give us the thumbs up. If you dislike it, please mark it down. If you have not yet subscribed to our channel, feel free to subscribe to our channel today and click on the notification bell. So anytime we record a new video, you will be the first person to be notified. Until the next time, enjoy your strength and be very happy. We are the 34SP, 24SP trading material traders talking about stochastic indicator, trading tips and tricks for stochastic traders. Happy trading to you all and I will speak to you soon. Thank you for watching.